Hi everybody, this video is for all you 4S, you ticked off 4S users who upgraded iOS 7 and you lost your uh, Wi-Fi, it got grayed out. I've actually used this method twice now so I know for sure that it's not a hardware issue, it is software. Um, as you can see on the, the screen here, I'm going to show you that I'm on version 702 and everything is working when I first put it on 70 because the tech requested me to whenever you have an issue or a hiccup with your phone they want you to be on the latest and greatest OS uh, so I was forced by Apple to put it there I lost the Wi-Fi and during the first few days I was actually able to downgrade back to 613 got the Wi-Fi back so I know that it's not a problem with the hardware when I called back, the technician recommended that since I had a fresh install, let's put it back to 7. I lost the Wi-Fi again. I'm also showing you there that the, the Bluetooth is working fine because I've heard that some people are having issues with that as well. So for the sake of this video, I actually took it past 702, put it on the new 703, and lost the Wi-Fi again. What a coincidence, right? So. I'm just going to show you um, the method that I use. I know it's crazy, it sounds silly, but I read about it over the internet. There's two that they're using right now. One's the freezer method, which doesn't seem to be working as well. And the other method is using a blow dryer. And what you're doing here is you're actually heating up the chip because the, the OS thinks that it's falsely already heated. When you heat up the chip, it actually resets whatever is in that chip to uh, allow the OS to see it normally. That's the best guess that I can give you on how this works. So you gotta have a blow dryer. Uh, you can't take your phone out of uh, Wi-Fi mode because you wouldn't be doing this unless it was already grayed out. And the intention is to actually stick the hot air from the, from the blow dryer at the top part of the phone, blow it into the, the microphone area and the top part of the phone and it might take you five minutes depending on how hot your blow dryer gets but I just kinda took it all around mine kept it mostly at the top and about three to five minutes later I got a warning message that came up on the phone and it says that the temperature is too hot and the phone won't operate for anything but an emergency call and that's exactly where you want it as soon as you get it like that you're going to uh, turn it off and I actually put mine in the fridge. There's what it looks like when you get that warning message in an iOS 7 phone. So I'm sorry that's a little shaky here, but that's what you want to see. Once you get that, you either just let it cool down on its own. I actually put mine in the fridge for a few minutes, about 10 minutes, let it cool down after turning it off. Then I turned it back on and that's what you're seeing here. I turned this as a little clip about five minutes, ten minutes after I turned it back on. And the Wi Fi is already working. I didn't even have to turn it back on. You can see that it's uh, available and connected to a network. So now I've hooked up this little application called Reflector, which allows you to have a much clearer view of it. So I'm going to walk you through to show you that the Wi Fi is not only working, it's connected, it's getting an address, it's on iOS 703. And as of the date of me making this, the, the voiceover for this, I'm about four days in uh, without a hiccup. So here I'm going to show you that it's on, yes, on 703. And it is a 4S that's uh, completely working Wi-Fi and um, definitely not a hardware issue. So Apple's, they know what this is going on. They're making a lot of money on a lot of customers asking them to upgrade their phones that are out of warranty it's telling them it's a hardware issue so I'm I'm hopefully just saving uh, you people out there a little bit of money on on the fact that it's it's not hardware you guys just try it I know it's silly but just put the phone try it do exactly what I showed you there and you'll be up and running 